Howdy again, folks. I want to talk about a word that we use and throw around in this industry, in this company called leverage. My concern is leverage, duplication, leader, these sort of words kind of lose their meaning when we, when we use them so darn often, many times out of context in the terms of the way that they're normally defined. But for the purpose of this conversation, I want to talk about leverage in a different sense. Yes, much of my check, much of many leaders' checks, much of your check comes from a leveraged business opportunity, from leveraging the efforts of the 100 people at 1%, et cetera, et cetera. I get that. Hallelujah for that concept and the power of that concept. And don't ignore or negate that. That is hugely powerful. So I refer to that as leverage in a southerly direction. I'm leveraging my downline. I'm trying to add value to them. I do these videos and hopefully more than one person sees them, in which case I'm doing something once, but it's been reviewed many, many times. But let's turn leverage on its head. Let's talk about leverage in a northerly direction. Let's talk about me and you. I make leveraged income off your and your people's efforts. Let's be frank about that. Doesn't that therefore imply that you have an opportunity, dare I say, obligation to then leverage in a northerly direction? Simply put, do not be chagrined or embarrassed or hesitant to leverage your upline. Use them. I don't know how many times in concluding some conversation in a hallway, at a meal, on stage, whatever the case may be, and said, hey, if you need my help, let me know. You know, if you have a prospect and you need someone to march with you and inviting them to get involved, then let me help you. And radio silence. Now, be mindful, they're dealing with many people beyond just yourself. But my concern is, I think, that many times we're nervous about extracting value from those who, let's be frank, are extracting value from us. They're the ones with the experience. They're the ones that get paid on the basis of their own and our efforts. So why wouldn't you feel more comfortable with appropriate courtesy to scheduling and timeframes and conflicts and all the usual common sense things that go there to leverage your upline? They're leveraging you. Why shouldn't you leverage them in a different way? So think of leverage more broadly. Yes, leverage works in a southerly direction. Begin to ponder how you could appropriately leverage yourself and the assets at your disposal, i.e. your upline, in a northerly direction. Leverage works both ways and feel comfortable putting it to work for and with you in both directions. Have a good day.